Hi everyone, it is June 3rd and we are behind on our to be reds for June, but here we are. And by the time this gets out, out, it'll probably be June, June 4th. 4th. <laughs> or 5th. <fifth. laughs> um, anyway, so we are behind. I said this in a previous video. I was gone um, visiting my in-laws this past weekend and we were trying to get it done and we just never got it done. And I had it. graduation with my kids, my students, so it's just been... You know what? We're not going to make yeah, excuses. Yeah, we say it every time. So. <laughs> we just are failures. That's all. That's all I have to say. We are failures. Yeah, we are. Anyway. And you guys all know that. Um, we are here to tell you what books we're going to be reading. Um, we still are finishing. We just were kind of finishing a little bit for me, but we're at the beginning. So it's okay. So our first book we're going to be reading, and we've already started. Sarah's already halfway through. I'm a page and a half in. I've told that in another video. Is we're going to do The Zodiac Academy. The Reckoning by, by Carolyn Peckham, Peckham and Susan Valenti, or Valente. What did you say? Valente, and I said Valenti. Valenti. <laughs> Valen. I don't know. <laughs> it's one of those. Um, okay, so this is book three. Um, if you have not read this, I say this whenever you bring up this series, go read it. Go, go pick read up one and two. One and two, and close your ears. Yeah, you might not want to hear this. For this next. I mean, I'm not going to spoil anything, but it, you know, it may kind of spoil book one and two. This book picks up right where book two left off after the nymph attack on the school, um, after the pit ball game. Um, and this kind of goes through the lunar eclipse that they are expecting, right? And yes. something's supposed to happen on the lunar eclipse, right? Yes. That we're yes. And this is called the reckoning. So, you know, there's a lot going on. And the reckoning is a big thing in the previous books because that's when we're going to see if the girls are what they're made of to see if they can pass it or not. Yes. And it's, it's, it, it goes through the, the freshmen, which the girls, Tori and Darcy, are freshmen. They have to go kind of through a hell week <laughs> given out by... Have they gone through a hell week already? <laughs> given oh, out... A couple months? Yes. Given out by the seniors of the school. So um, we're kind of, kind of just following on the journey of that and then the upcoming lunar eclipse. It's basically the journey of Darcy and Tori and the heirs and Lance Orion. That's the journey we're on. Yes. So, um, I was trying really hard not to spoil anything because I've already am half more than halfway through this book and, um, yeah, and I'm loving it. So that is one of our first book actually we're for the month of June. We won't have too many withdrawals that we can't not put the next book down. Well, according to her, she heard that book three and four are hard to put down. So I don't know if we were like, oh, I can't do it. We might add another book for it. We'll see. We might have to. Okay. And on to our second book of the month would be, which we have been dying because we are huge, huge fans of Danielle L. Jensen of The Bridge Kingdom and The Traitor Queen. I was obsessed with it. I really was. It was one of my top books of the year last year. I even got a former teacher hooked on it. Actually, I should tell her this one. I was going to say, did you tell her? No, I didn't. I didn't think about it. Anyways, mm -hmm. uh, The Inadequate Heir by Danielle L. Jensen. I'm excited. I'm really excited for this. I love um, Aaron and Lara, um, so I'm going to miss that. <clears throat> I know. Sometimes I have a hard time, like, do I really want to pick up a new? I mean, even though we'll end up liking it, but sometimes I have, I get such an attachment to someone. I'm like, I don't want to move from that. It's like Carval. When you read Carval. Yeah. I don't want to move on. And then we had, a, we went to Once Upon a Broken Heart, even though I loved, I loved Jax. Um, I was afraid I was going to miss those old characters, but I think I just loved Jax so much yeah. that I didn't care. <laughs> so I'm hoping that's how this is going to be. Um, yeah. And I'm excited with um it's an endless war of a forbidden love of a forbidden love so listen it's zara and karis karis is actually the brother to laura who we loved in um the inadequate or the bridge Queen kingdom and um war Trader the, <laughs> we're not doing <laughs> the we're not Queen. doing from blood and ash well, the yeah, trader yeah, queen something wrong with me <laughs> um anyways and then there's zara whose mother, I believe, was murdered, right? Mother, right? Her mother, yeah, mother was murdered. And she's on a path of vengeance. She wants to figure it out. She's trying to, like, go and kill whoever did that. But she keeps meeting this 
handsome, nameless man who comes in and won't leave her alone, basically, I think. We know those yeah. men. And anyways, she starts to fight this war of, do I want to continue the path I am on or am I going to kind of be, you know, let this man in type thing. You know, the, the, this is how all those books go. It's probably going to be, uh, um, what's the kind of books we love where they hate each other to love each other? Oh, um, from enemies to, to lovers. lovers. Yes. I'm assuming. I think that will be. So we even... And it's forbidden. I love them. My favorites, too. Anyways, so we are going to be reading this one. And we're really excited. And so, when I bought this. So I did explain this on Sarah's um, itty-bitty, tiny, teeny, weeny book call. Book call. No, she did without me, mind you. I follow Danielle Jensen on Instagram. And she did say when Inadequate Air is coming out, she said, if you have purchased this book go ahead and go to her like onto her account and you can put in that you purchased where you purchased it and you can get a free copy of um laura and aaron's like an extended bonus scene and i believe it's like i don't know three to six i again i don't do my research always three to six chapters maybe and it's going to be catching us watch it be one we just know. wing it on these videos <laughs> that's what we're here for um, anyways, they it's following where they are now, and you do have to read it after this book. So I have it. They emailed it to us, and I have it. We got to get it on like iBooks or something, and then we will kind of cover. So that will be our third book, um, a tiny itty bitty book on Laura and Aaron of the Bridge Kingdom, which I'm really excited because I'm having. I always have a hard time moving on from these characters, so at least we'll get them again. So book three will probably be of the month, the Laura and Aaron book we'll add that in and then get a little review on that so anyway this is third then lauren aaron will be our fourth and then we have which we have been waiting for for this is our long? second what did i say third <laughs> no lauren aaron's third did i not say no that? you said this is our our third and then lara and aaron be our fourth i i probably did <laughs> our second book is inadequate air lauren aaron is our third and the book, the fourth book that we have been waiting on, that we need more of in our lives. That we also that we are obsessed love. With. We need more Warwick Farkas. This is not the book, but I was saying that's not it. <laughs> but it is the <laughs> and Brex, we need Brex. The lands, <laughs> this is the lands. What is it called? The Shadowlands Shadow Lands. series. It's going to be Shadowlands. Yes. Um, it's the last book, apparently. Oh, yes. This is the book I was trying to tell the Barnes and Lady about. It needed to Barnes end, Barnes and Noble. What is it called? Barnes and Lady. <laughs> uh, oh, my God. Sometimes I don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> um, now, listen. We are, we are obsessed with this one as well. Um, it is such a good this series. This is such a little gem to find. And um, Sarah had heard of it, and we had a reviewer. A, a review. <laughs> I cannot talk. We had a commenter um, about last fall, maybe summer, that said, please read it. And even though you heard of that, we finally picked up. And what a gem it was. It was this series. So much fun. I loved it. It was so fun. But I do feel like it needs to end. I do. So I'm glad this is the last book. But I'm sad because yeah. I love these characters so so much. It's not just Brexley and Warwick you love. You love the side characters. Scorpion. Yes. Um, Cardin, Hannah. You love all of them. You really start Who's to... Who's the hot, um, best friend of Warwick? I can't remember his name. The oh, Killian. Killian. No. Oh, but, but I Killian. love Killian. Yeah. Um, um, I don't know. Best friend? Scorpion. No. Warwick's best friend that he's known all his life and he's the healer. I don't remember. <laughs> um, Ash. I think, oh, Ash. Ash. Okay. I think it's Ash. So there are six books. Well, Shadowland is the sixth book. Um, and we're really excited. And we're you know, we're get... leaving off where uh, Brexley runs, basically. And we're excited. She's not getting away from me. <laughs> yeah. She basically becomes like the, not the villain, but the. Um... Well, like a, without meaning to be villain. Yes. So, um, the work doesn't care. He's just like, no, she's mine. Yeah. I'm getting her back. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yes. So that is our, and that's by book. Stacey Marie Brown. Um, yes. So that it is uh, Shadowlands, right? 
shadow we don't have it obviously here no. so um that will be in this book which we're excited and then we're like like i said we're if we have big withdrawals book four of uh zodiac <laughs> yeah we may be coming <laughs> yes us. but that's it that's our um book feeds of the month sorry it's late um we're trying to catch up on things and hopefully we can not be failures which we do fail sometimes. We should just change our name on here to yes. the Danny and Sarah the failures. <laughs> book, book club. Yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, so tell us what you think. Um, have you read any of them yet? Um, maybe. I know Zodiac Academy. Majority of you have. Have, have you they? read the Inadequate? Have? Probably. Have you read Inadequate Air yet? Um, have you read the, the majority of that? and Aaron scene? Uh, well, yeah. I mean, come on. Shadowlands, any of them? Let us know what you think. Yeah. Are you excited to get to any of them? Yes, I'd love you? to know. Anyways, we'd love for you to subscribe and like our video, and we will hopefully be here soon with a review soon. Yep. We'll see you guys soon. Bye.